Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for April 22nd and 23rd, Monday and Tuesday, for my Libras. Hello, my Libras. How was your weekend? I hope it was marvelous. I really, really do. Okay, so I'm just using, this is the short reading, so I just used my Dorian Virtue Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated. Okay, you want to come up? Sure. I have prayed, meditated, and infused with Reiki energy, and this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate with you. Take what you like, leave the rest. Okay, please remember to like, share, and subscribe, and click on that little bell. Okay, so we had five cards that just had to come out. Okay, so the first four are reversed. And I, I'm sorry, the first four are face down. Um, and let's just go with them. Okay, the first one is the four of water. Water, of course, is our Cancer, Pisces, and our Scorpio energy. It's our fluidity. It's how we adapt. Um, it's also how, you know, our emotional energy, too. So this one is saying missing an opportunity, discontentment or boredom. Open your eyes to the possibilities. Okay, let's go on to this next card. This next card is awakening archangel gabriel so here is the messenger the divine messenger coming to you saying look at things a little differently than what you're doing so here we have this thing where it's saying missing an opportunity um discontentment of boredom open your eyes to the possibility and here we have right next to it the awakening or awakening with archangel gabriel saying hey you know keep your eyes open keep your ears open keep things open because there's things that you're, you're, you know, there are things that are right out there that you're not necessarily seeing. And, or maybe it's just that you don't want to see them, okay? Because sometimes if you don't want to see them, then you might have to do something about it. But that's just type, that's the type of energy this is. When I'm, when I give examples, it doesn't mean, I just give that so that you can have an understanding of what I'm talking about. It may not be a specific example for you, okay? But it is, you know, I do feel, though, that this is basically keep your eyes open. Many times there's that saying, keep your eyes open and your mouth shut, okay? So, you, you know, and also then keep your ears open, too, okay? So here, these, these, this card now is reversed. So here we go. The king of water. So again, there's going to be a lot of this emotional energy going on. But the king, though, is, of course, the king is, um, you know, I'm feeling very tenderhearted, very loving towards you this these two days let's see what this says well trustworthy compassionate respected cultured open your heart and mind to those around you trustworthy and heartfelt advice charity work so here we have i mean do you see the do you see the pattern right now you know missing your you know missing an opportunity look at things from a different um you know perspective i told you to keep your eyes and your ears open now this is saying though to keep your your heart and your mind open too. So it's like it's like maybe you're going to have maybe this energy is something that you've got your mind really set on this and you're going to miss a bigger picture because you're so set on a on your 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 like you know it's like you have tunnel vision and maybe you're going to miss some of the blessings that are around you. Not quite sure. There's just a lot of um water energy and you're getting a lot of um advice to basically say keep keep your eyes open look at things look at you know be aware it's like you know like you need to have your awareness okay this card is also reversed and here we have the nine of air air is of course your energy it's also gemini and aquarius energy it's the wi-fi energy it's your thoughts and this one is expecting the worst self-fulfilling prophecy sleepless nights so here we have, you know, we have this water energy, this fluid energy, this emotional energy that's saying to you, hey, be, be aware. And yet at the same time, you are going around, you know, thinking these horrible, horrible thoughts. And I'm not saying you're thinking horrible thoughts, but you're just not necessarily, um, you know, you're, you're, you're expecting that you're expecting things that aren't that, you know, you're, it says you're expecting the worst. OK, but Archangel Gabriel is here to say, hey, just look at things a little differently and you're going to actually see the more, you're going to actually see how things are working out for you in a better way than you even thought. But you have to look at it differently, okay? So 
This is the last card, and this one is also reversed, but it came face up. And this is, again, that water energy. Again, this emotional energy, but it's also fluid. And remember, yeah, so think of yourself, and this is kind of hard, but think of things as passing through you, okay? You know, think of that, you know, think of it as, okay, what's going on now is going to be passing, you know, passing through. So when you are expecting the worst, when you aren't thinking positive thoughts, you know, it, it's kind of like, um, you know, well, this is because I was a labor and delivery nurse, but it's kind of like labor. And it's, you know, it's, 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 and I would tell, hey, you won't be pregnant tomorrow. It will pass through. And you have a lot of water saying it will pass through. So if you are stuck in some, you know, in some negative thinking, in some stinking thinking, it's gonna, it, it's gonna pass through, okay? And so this one, the night of water, emotional, romantic, enthusiastic, contemplative. Falling in love or wedding proposal, the need to balance emotions, an invitation to a social event. Again, this big fluidity, this, it's major, major fluidity, major emotional fluidity. Make sure you keep your thoughts positive because it's, it, you know, this is what's going to keep, I'm feeling like, you know, with all this water and if your thoughts, you know, if you don't keep your thoughts positive, it's like a dam that's stopping the flow of this, Okay. But I keep going back to Archangel Gabriel, the messenger, the divine messenger saying, hey, you know, just look at things a little differently, okay? Actually, it's not, it's not a, you know, the energies are not going to be bad. It's, it's going to be based upon how you, you know, how, what your perspective is going to be. And you have Archangel Gabriel saying, look at things differently. Okay, so my Libras, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.